What's in your attic? Well, one Elmira man found a rare first edition journal from Lewis and Clark's famous expedition to the Pacific Northwest. Art Thompson found the copy in his mother's attic over 30 years ago and recently donated it to a museum in North Dakota. WNYHD's Kelly Meyer joins us live in his studio with the story. Kelly, this is some find. Jennifer, Art had that same reaction when he was telling us the story. Imagine finding an important piece of American history right in your house. 30 years ago, Art Thompson found this book in his mom's attic. Like a lot of people who find these old beat up books, he just threw it aside. That was until a friend noticed it and told him it's worth more than $20,000. Look carefully in your attic. It's a rare first edition journal by Patrick Gass, one of the sergeants on Lewis and Clark's expedition to the Pacific Northwest. Published in 1807, the first account ever published of the Lewis and Clark journey. We never really had any interest in Lewis and Clark before this, but we do now. Art and his wife decided to retrace the steps of Lewis and Clark. The journey took old Lewis and Clark two years and took the Thompsons only a month and led them to Washburn, North Dakota, home of the Lewis and Clark Interpretive Center, where Art decided to donate his attic find. But a donation like this doesn't come along very often. We just had a gentleman that came in, heard about the donation, and asked to see the book. And so it's bringing, it's, it's stimulating visitation here at our, our uh, little place of, of Lewis and Clark history in North Dakota. But just how did this book end up in his family's attic? There was a name on the trip, a gentleman by the name of John B. Thompson. Well, was he related to us? I mean, this is all stuff we found out along the trip. So now the question is, is it possible that the book was in our attic because John B. Thompson's related to us and it came from Patrick? So now at 67, Art is going on an adventure of his own. Yeah, we don't know. We have no idea, but we will, we will know. The journey has just begun for us. The journal is expected to arrive at the museum tomorrow. Kelly Meyer, WENY HD News.